Now, I know a lot of people like dealing with their EQs and messing around with their sound and having complete and utter control over their audio uh, the best that they possibly can. Well, there's this nifty little program that is called Easy Effects. And what Easy Effects allows you to do is auto gain, bass enhancer, bass loudness, compressor. Uh, there's a whole list is right there in front of you. This app covers absolutely everything that you need and more. Now installing it's pretty easy. You can download it on the flat pad on the flat hub. So I guess if you wanted to, you could head in here and you could easily search for easy effects and it's right there. Now it only seems to be available through no I'm kidding. It's got a Nabora Linux one. It's got an official flat hub and so on. So you can easily install it me. I'm going to not install it through flat. I'm going to install it through Nabora because uh, I want a native application. You choose whatever you want. Okay. And I'm sure they have other installation methods as well. I, I believe on normal Fedora, you can just install it through DNF. And once that's done, we can open it up and I can go and take a look at it. Now, I just want to open up my other window here. Where is it? Because I want to drag this over there for later for when I upload this video. All right, so this is it. Here it is. I've got no players. I got nothing going on. I do have my input, which is right here. And I do have pipe wire, which allows you to do a bunch of things. So you got default stuff, uh, tells you my sampling rate. It tells you my quantum, which is 32. And we need to open up something that plays music for me to be able to mess with this. So for all legal reasons, my desktop audio is muted. So haha, you can't hear my music. And I'm going to just hit shuffle. I don't want to hear my music either because then I'll get distracted. But as you can see, we have two things that popped up, Chromium and Chromium. These are both playbacks for uh, what I was using. And you can see there's presets. And I believe it was more in depth than this. Oh, did it end up quitting? It did not. All right, I'm gonna have to turn it up a little. To get to the effects. So we can add whatever we want. Bass loudness, if we needed to. And that pretty much should just make it a lot bassier, which it did, by the way. We can also add an equalizer. I added it twice. We're going to trash one of those. And I'm going to get rid of that. So you could see that it supports APO and graphic. APO is something that uh, they pre-built EQs for specific headphones and stuff. So if I was to actually go into Firefox, um, NHT 100 road is that what they're called the nth 100 okay nth 100 road apo all right apo equalizer and there's a whole thing here for that by the way and i'm just trying to find it aha auto eq and if we do the search NHT is that what it was called I don't remember anymore crap you know what I'm just gonna search road there they are so front dampening removed that's me front dampening removed so you got fixed band graphics EQ there's a whole bunch of these measurements here okay and it basically does everything for you. It adjusts it, makes it work. I know a lot of people, I've had a couple of people ask for this already, so it's pretty easy for me to make this recommendation. But I don't know which one to choose. Let's go with this one. So you can just download this as a raw file. And then we go in here and we import the APO. And APO not loaded, format not supported. Okay. 
so that one's not supported. What about this one? I gotta find the specific one. Let's try this one. There we go. That one seems to have done something. So let me listen to catch my breath here real quick. Wow. It sounded good before, but now it sounds a tiny bit better. Huh. This is pretty good. This actually works. There's not much adjustment to do for my headphones, by the way, because, well, they're already almost perfect. Uh, if you want to know about them, they were rated by a complete, a complete insane lunatic as the most balanced headphones he's ever heard. So whatever, it's up to you to believe what you need to believe. Damn. I like it. It, it kind of brings up the bass a little bit and it adds a little bit of clarity to the vocals. This sounds good. I'm going to keep this. Anyway, this is the application. I figured I'd let you know about it so you can mess with your EQs and do whatever you need to do. Don't forget to subscribe. I have a goal of 30,000 this year subscribers, and I want you to be one of them. I need you. You know, one of those things. We cover Linux and uh, emulation, Rage Inc, and a whole bunch of other emulators. I'm preparing a Xenia video for the Vulcan backend to show where it currently is. So stay tuned for that if you're into that. And I'll see you guys next time.